Art is a plowed field. You plow the field and you don't know what's going to spring up from the earth having been turned over. And we know if you grew up on a farm, you can leave a you can leave a you can let a field go to pasture, mm -hmm. and small trees start appearing. Right. Um, grasses start appearing. Mm -hmm. uh, flowering plants we call them weeds start appearing. Uh, wild raspberry and blackberries start appealing. All sorts of things that. Uh, are not raised in a straight line and cultivated as uh, food. Um, so you don't know what's going to turn up each year if you plow, if that art world is plowed over. Right. So, so Richard, you and I are talking by Zoom. Uh, mm -hmm. Everyone across America uh, is self-isolating uh because of the coronavirus uh we don't know how this is going to work out economically uh we we hope everyone survives this uh we don't know what the future is we do know for certain our world has changed mm -hmm. so in a sense for art this is a huge plowing taking place. We're in turmoil. We may be calm in our homes. We're in the middle of this uh, pandemic now. We don't know what the outcome's going to be. Right. And so we can look out and we can see this giant field where the earth is being turned over and, and it's barren at this point we don't know when this is over what seeds are going to take place and sprout in that field of art. And I would encourage all of us that are watching to think of ourselves in that position. Go a little, you have this moment of high anxiety. I know we're all worrying about loved ones. We're worrying about many, many things. Um, you shouldn't be under any pressure to be creative now, but I encourage you to be open to looking really deep inside and determining what it is that's important to you. And for me, that's the most important source for your creativity. Yeah. Wow. I, it couldn't have been said more beautifully and eloquently at this pivotal time that we're at in uh, what you've just said. And I mean, it really brings up emotions because that really is at the core, I think, of our encouragement to anybody that wants to express themselves artistically is you can't deny the influences around you, nor who you are or you're meant to be. And so, uh, don't embrace denial about it and uh, see what comes from it. 